Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer, and I've been playing Oblivion for a very, very long time. And there are some favorite unique items I have. There's some favorite items that I have in this game, and I'd like to tell you guys about them. So, the first item that I, I love and adore and never play a game without it is Umbra. I don't know why, because Umbra isn't the best sword in the game. Umbra is like, yeah, it has high normal damage, but in terms of raw damage, you could make, you could get better swords than Umbra. But I just, I don't know what it is about Umbra, but it is my favorite freaking sword in the game. I love it. I try not to have a playthrough without it. And for that, I also prefer a Diedrich Claymore to go with it. Like, that, that combo of, like, Umbra plus a Diedrich Claymore with, like, some insanely high damage buff. That, that's, like, my favorite weapon combo of all time in Sky er, in Oblivion. That's, like, my favorite thing to do, to use. I also really, really like the, um, what do you call it? The scales you get from, I don't remember what they are, from the Dark Brotherhood. Because it's like having a dope buff to just drop your personality, right? Nah, screw having cheaper prices. You become rich in Oblivion if your merchantile's zero. If it's negative 100, you can become rich in Oblivion. It's fine. I also really like Spellbreaker. That's a fun shield. Or the Mirror Shield. I feel like with Spellbreaker and the Mirror Shield, you can just kind of pick, okay, your heavy armor, you use heavy armor. If you're a light armor character, you use light armor, you know? I kind of feel like there's that meta going on with those things. But... I really like that combo of stuff, at least. Well, the combo of Spellbreaker or Mirror Shield. I, I'm a Zelda fan. Like, I think I value Zelda, the Zelda name, over the Elder Scrolls name. Oblivion's my favorite game. But don't get me wrong, I will take two Zelda games over Oblivion any day. Except, it's two games that I like. So, the Mirror Shield, you know, very much a big fan of Zelda and... I like that there's a reference in there to it. I also really like the Amulet of Axes. I think that's a pretty awesome, unique item. I don't really go for a lot of the Diedrich items, but I find myself using the Black Band a lot. I don't even remember what it does. All I know is that I like it. I don't, like, the Umbra Black Band and that amulet you get from the Mage's Guild. What's it called? The one that absorbs health. Or not absorbs health, absorbs spells. See, I don't know the names of these items, but I really like them. A lot. I, I really like that absorb thing, because I, I like making battle mages and and um, night blades, you know? I really like those two kind of class setups. So I really like, I like that safety net of having that extra magic coming in constantly, you know? So, you know, we got Umbra, Spellbreaker, Black Band. We also have the Amulet that absorbs things. The Amulet of Axes for when I want to level up Blunt. I really like that. And the Mirror Shield I really like. And there's really not much else I can say unique items-wise I like in Oblivion. Of course, you know, Wabajack's a nice one. Um, all those unique Diedrich items that you get. The, the other staff, the Skull of Corruption, is really cool. But I find myself in Oblivion, the unique items, I don't tend to use them, the unique ones, a lot, right? Like, I feel like when it comes to creating the full-on, like, the god-tier character, I use the unique items to get me to the items of, like, a full set of Diedrich or a full set of Glass enchanted to my liking to really help my character out. I don't use the unique items, except for Umbra, of course, and Spellbreaker, and Mirror Shield, for that example. Um, but I feel like I don't use them. There's a, there's a, always going to be a point where they get replaced by something else, right? On my characters, at least I feel like it's that way. Like, I can just, they just get replaced, you know? And that, that's what happens, right? Like, Umbra, for instance, on my my most recent Oblivion character, Umbra got replaced by a Diedrich Claymore and a Diedrich Dagger. It just did. Right? Even though it's 
my favorite sword, it got replaced. So, that's my take on my favorite unique items. Not a lot of them. Um, they're really the ones I go for. They're the ones that stick with me. They're the ones that speak to me. Um, spell abs Basically, Spell Absorption, Purple Sword of Death, and Amulet of Axis to help me with my blood skill. Uh, cool shield that reflects magic. And that's it. Oh, Spell Drinker is the name of the amulet that I really like that you have to do the Mage's Guild to get to. So guys, that's really it for this video. If you enjoyed, you can tell me in the comments below. Subscribe if you're new for more Oblivion videos. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games, and I will see you in the next episode, stream, vlog, or Instagram post of whatever I decide to make.